I've got a few comments asking how to remove uh, a green screen in Paint.net and in this video I'm gonna show you how to do that. First you need to select the magic wand up here and then just left click on the green and lower the tolerance a bit like that. If we zoom in with the control and scroll and if we increase the tolerance you'll see it gets selected here which we don't want so we need to lower the tolerance like that should be fine. So we can zoom out, control, scroll. But now you'll see this isn't selected and if we just left click, the, the old selection will get deleted. So undo. What we need to do is hold control because they'll make a new selection without, without removing the old one. Like that. So just hold control. That's all you have to do. And uh, if you wanna remove a selection without removing all of them, you can hold alt and remove it. So, um, all you have to do now is press delete. And there we go! But there's an ugly edge around Mario here, so we want to remove it. This method requires a few plugins, I'll have them in the description. And I'll also link a video showing how to install them. So now I'm gonna assume you have done that. So now we need to go to effects, object, and feather. Maybe like... Yeah, let's go with six. Okay, and now go to effects again, as my Gerund tools, and Alpha works. And now we want to increase the contrast and decrease the percentage. Like that. If we zoom out, it looks pretty good now. But if you have the wrong settings on your camera, the green screen or blue screen or whatever, uh, your green screen process will be harder. Here's an example. There's a lot of blur. Uh, uh, in the back, as you'll see here and uh, here. And you'll see there's some green at the top here from, uh, well, the, the green screen. So uh, this will make it harder, but it, it's still possible to remove it. So first we need to just left click on the green to make a selection and uh, change the tolerance a bit. Like that. But now you'll see that uh, this isn't selected, but remember what we did earlier. Just hold down control and make another selection like that and then maybe you wanna just go with the regular rectangle select and hold down control and make a selection here like that and zoom in a bit here we can do the same here uh, like there and there like that and now we'll go here and do the same I'll pick the magic wand this time like that and rectangle select, hold down control as usual. There we go. Oh, <laughs> a few pixels here. Uh, there we go. And now just press delete. There we go. But there's still an edge as before, so we need to remove it. Effects, object, feather. Okay. Effects, as my good tools, alpha works. Like that. Uh, we don't care about this, we only care about the, the redstone block. So now we need to remove the green here. What we need to do is go to adjustments and color mixer and just remove the green entirely and the yellow too because there is some yellow. Like that. And now it's done. So that was how to remove a green screen or well, it can be any color, it can be blue, pink, whatever. And I have provided these images in the description if you wanna practice this. And the plugins I used in the video are in the description. And that's all I have to say, so thanks so much for watching, bye!